All right, guys, it's your boy Nilla G, and it's better half the gypsy. And today we're trying pork rinds, five different kinds. So, the five different kinds we're going to try are Ghost Pepper Jack, Nashville Hot Style, Spicy Dill, Jalapeno. And queso. So a couple different uh, brands and five different flavors. We'll get right into it now. All right, what do you want to try first, Tammy? Go from mildest to hottest. So we'll do queso, spicy dill, jalapeno, hot style, and then ghost pepper jack. Queso first. This is made from the Bacon's Corporation, Baconettes, Baconettes, fried pork skins, queso. Savor the flavor. We have had these and we know they're good. So queso flavored, let's see what it tastes like. There's a, a zing to it, what would you call that? It's not lime. It's just some kind of zinc. You're getting the pork flavor, but the coating has got almost a vinegar taste, but not really vinegar. Something sweet and zingy. And it tastes like queso cheese. Thumbs up. Thumbs up. We'll move right on to the spicy dill pork rind. This is made by they're fried in sunflower oil. I don't know who makes these. Southern recipe, small batch. Made in Lima, Ohio. Hand selected, cooked in small batches, free from artificial colors, and contains zero trans fat. SouthernRecipeSmallBatch.com. SouthernRecipeSmallBatch.com. Spicy dill. I can smell dill right off the bat. You can see a little bit of pepper on there. So it tastes like a, a dill ranch kind of flavor. Let me get out of this crazy. Is that, is that better? Recipe number 30. SouthernRecipeSmallBatch.com Those are good. A lot of dill like flavor. Mm -hmm. Like a dill ranch. All right, now we're going into Max. Max makes a lot of uh, pork rinds that we like. This one is jalapeno. Salt, jalapeno pepper, and onion powder. Let's check it out. Mmm, get the jalapeno right off the bat. Mm 
too old. Damn. Those are good though. We've had them. That bag, I don't know how long it's been in there, but they're no good that way. They're no good stale. So if you get them, get them fresh. But there is a lot of jalapeno flavor there. All right, next one. We're trying Max again. See, even new kind of labels and stuff. This is the old one. It says new flavor. And this is what their bags look like now. So I don't know how old those are. It might be about four months old. These are new. Nashville hot style. Max. But if you come across the jalapeno ones and you like jalapeno, try them. They're good. They really are. Now this will show how crunchy Max are. Mmm. Nashville hot. It's like a smoky, sweet barbecue flavor with heat. That's exactly what I'd say. Rich and smoky barbecue seasoning with brown sugar, paprika, and spices. Balanced with a kick of pepper. Heat. Flavor that lingers. Mmm. Licking your fingers is not only acceptable, it's required. Tastes like I'm at a barbecue. Like I'm pulling the pork off the barbecue meat. That's really good. Those are really good. And now we're getting to the one that Jamie wants to try the most. Ghost Pepper Jack. Also made by Mac. Got the little flames on the package. This is in pink and darker pink. Made with real ghost peppers to challenge the true heat seekers. Introducing our latest creation, Ghost Pepper Jack. Intense peppery heat balance with a creamy cheese flavor for a well-rounded taste that delivers. Ghost chili peppers, paprika, natural smoke. Oh boy. I like those peppers. I smell pork, and that's about it. I smell cheese. It's like a white cheese dust, like a white cheddar maybe, on the outside. Oh, Jack. Probably Jack. getting hot heat down my throat now. That is amazing. That's a snack I can enjoy. Jimmy likes the Nashville hot. She's going to cool her mouth off from the ghost pepper jack with the Nashville hot. So, my favorite ghost pepper, then the Nashville hot. I do like the jalapeno, but they weren't very good stale. So eat them quick. And then these two are probably a tie, the queso and the um, spicy these dill. You've got to be in the mood for dill if you want the spicy dill. But there, are, there's a little bit of black pepper heat there. It's a good pork rind. Definitely a good pork rind. Got to be in the mood for dill. But be good with, um, you know, submarine sandwiches or um, hamburgers, anything you're going to have pickles on. This would be a great little side dish. Or on it. All right. I hope you enjoyed these five kinds of pork grinds. This has been Food Reviews and Taste Test with the Gypsy and the Vanilla Gorilla, which is a long title, but short reviews. We'll see you next time. Peace, y'all. Peace, y'all. Order of favorite.
queso, dill, Nashville hot, and then the ghost pepper she didn't like. No, I like the cheese on it. It's just too hot. The, che the cheese flavor is really good. The pork rind is really good, but it's spicy. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.